Hey guys and welcome to another unboxing. So today we're going to be focusing on the Kyocera Reach. Really, really nice. One of the newer phones that just came out for Boost Mobile. So even here it says waterproof. Whoop. If I can get that out of focus. Three feet for 30 minutes. Really, really nice. It's a new Boost Mobile Kyocera Reach phone. So this is one of the newer ones. Let's see how it is. So we're doing the unboxing. Let's see some of the specs. So certified waterproof and dustproof. 5 inch QHD um, touchscreen display, Android 5.1 Lollipop, 5 megapixel rear facing camera, 2 megapixel front facing camera, 3G slash 4G slash enhanced LTE. That's what the phone looks like. So, Kyocera, we Boost Mobile has carried a lot of Kyocera phones um, lately since you know the first one now. I think the Icon was one of the newer ones that came out. Here's some quick specs, 8 gigabytes of ROM, 1 gigabyte of RAM, 2160 milliamp battery, non-removable battery that is, so you cannot take off the back, guessing they do that for the waterproof uh, feature, 1.1 uh, gigahertz quad core processor, so not the best specs, um, and also, you know, it, for it being uh, $100 price range for this phone. So let's pop this baby open and see what we have inside. So there we go. Let's see, this is my first time opening this phone too. Pretty cool. I like the design on the box. It shows little splashes of water. Pretty, pretty cool. So here we go. Whoa. This phone looks amazing for being five inches. Wow. It says you can't. I'm guessing you can remove the back. Yep. You can remove the back, but it has a non removable battery. Whoa, look at this thing, guys. Let's see if I can focus it. Pretty cool. Look, look where the SD card goes. It's like. Look at that. Roborize for me and for it being, you know, water resistant water resistant really really nice so let me put the back on there as you can see on the back right here this is where let me zoom in or autofocus I mean this is where you know that's how it's water resistant so if water ever gets into it it will basically stop the water from going into the back of the phone so now that we have the back of it looks nice let's look in the front with my fingerprints on it so on the bottom we have the charging port on the right we have the power button on the left we have the volume rocker up volume up and volume down on the top you had your headphone jack of course in the back you have your five megapixel camera with your rear speaker and it does have a flash really nice look look at the design on the back it's kind of see if i can get it out of focus yeah, there we go. It's kind of... It does... Definitely, definitely, it's not smooth. It feels nice in the hand. So, that's the phone. Let's see what else we get inside the box. So, you do have your manual. It's kind of weird. They're, the manuals are usually, I don't know, together. Like, you know, with a little band or something, at least. Piece of paper. But at least the, the guidebook is really helpful compared to the other ones that are really not... So you have your um, AC charger and then your USB connector. Really, really nice. So yeah, guys, that's my little unboxing of the Kyocera Reach, new Boost Mobile device. What do you think? Are you going to get this phone? Let me know. Uh, do you believe in the brand? Usually, I don't know, Kyocera hasn't done really well with Boost Mobile, but who knows? I'm going to do a review on this phone pretty soon and see how that does. So thank you for watching guys, please comment, rate, subscribe, and follow me on the social media, you know, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, all that good stuff for more. Thank you.